Perhaps the most fundamental philosophical question that you can ask in science is why are we here? I'm Robert Dijkgraaf. I'm the director and Leon Levy professor at the Institute for Advanced Study in Princeton and I'm a theoretical physicist. To understand the universe, we have to bring together the two key ideas that are governing modern physics. On the one hand, we have Einstein's theory of relativity that describes the largest structures in the universe in terms of curvature of space and time. On the other hand, we have quantum theory, which very successfully describes the elementary particles. But it also has issues. For instance, in quantum mechanics, you never know exactly what's going to happen. The best thing you can do is calculate the probability for something to happen. If we look in the very distant past of the universe and we see kind of the baby photo of the universe, we see little spots. And these spots in the end grew to galaxies, to stars, to planets, to us. So it could be that the intrinsic randomness of quantum theory, the fact that things are not uniform, but they're always fluctuating a little bit, like the surface of a pool where you have small waves, that actually these small fluctuations give rise to everything we see around us. And so the fundamental feature of quantum theory, the fact that there is chance, that Einstein famously said, well, he didn't believe that got through dices, but actually that the throwing of the dice and probability caused the structure that we see in the universe. And I feel that's a very poetic and also very satisfying way to answer that fundamental question.